Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. This tutorial show you how to record screen and webcam with a completely free and powerful screen recorder for making online training videos. The program I am going to use is Atomy Active Presenter, an all-in-one screen recorder, video editor and e-learning authoring tool for Windows and Mac OS. In my opinion, this is one of the best free screen recorders on the market now. Here is the download page of Active Presenter which you can find the link in the description. There are different versions for Windows and Mac OS. Just make sure that you select the right version for your operating system. Also don't forget to check out its system requirement at this download page. Let's launch Active Presenter from my computer now. To record screen and webcam, click record screen at the start page. This is Active Presenter recording toolbar where you can select your recording options. This is full screen mode. And this is custom mode which allows you to select an area on the screen to record. For example, I can select 720p from this drop down menu. And now I can move this recording area around the screen to where I want to record. Added to that, Active Presenter also lets you record a specific running application when this option is checked. It can be a software, or an opening web browser on your computer. For this example, I will select full screen mode which is my favorite mode when making software tutorial using Active Presenter. On the right side of the window, you can easily see recording webcam and audio function. Click here to turn on webcam recording option. Select this drop down menu to customize your webcam video. Here is just some of the basic settings for your webcam. You can leave it by default, or customize it like the way you want. Click this button to turn on audio recording options. With Active Presenter, you can select record audio from microphone and system sound simultaneously. Being mentioned that your screen recording, your external audio, system audio and your webcam will be recorded in different tracks. It's very easy to customize these video later in Active Presenter's video editor. I will show you later when the recording is finished. Click this gear icon to deep dive into your recording settings. Remember to select flash screen video if you want to get smaller recording file. This option is highly recommended for those of you who record very long tutorial video. All other settings here can be default. At the cursor tab, remember to enable record mouse cursor and cursor effect so that you can edit it later in Active Presenter's editor. You can ignore this annotation tab because it's related to making a software simulation. At the hotkeys tab, you will see the hotkeys to stop and pause the recording. I will click save and start the recording now. After the countdown timer, everything on my computer screen and my webcam will be recorded. When finish, you can press Ctrl plus end on your keyboard, or select Active Presenter at the notification area at the bottom right corner on the screen. There are some information about the number of recorded frames, number of dropped frames as well as the duration of the video here too. Click this button to stop the recording. Now you will be redirected to Active Presenter's video editor where you can edit your recording. On the preview canvas, you can see my screen recording and my webcam at the corner. At the bottom is the editing timeline where our screen video, webcam video and audio tracks are displayed. They are displayed in different tracks which you can easily edit with affecting other objects on the timeline. This is a professional feature of Active Presenter which you can get for free. For example, I can resize my webcam and move it around the screen to where I want it to appear. Or hide my webcam by clicking on this eye button. You can also insert text, shapes, zoom effect as well as cut 
Trim your video right inside this video editor before exporting to a specific video format for uploading to YouTube or other video sharing platforms. To learn more about Active Presenter, click the playlist I put at top right corner of the video to watch more tutorials about Active Presenter on my channel. Let's export the project so that you can watch the result now. With Active Presenter, you export and save your video into your computer with this video export option, or upload directly to YouTube with a registered account. Normally, I will export to video format and upload to YouTube manually. And here is the final result, I did not export the audio because I am sitting in my office now. I don't want to grab the attention of my staffs. The quality of the recording is great, right? That's all I want to share with you in this tutorial. If you have any question, lets me know at the comments section below. Thanks very much for watching and I will see you in my next videos. Bye for now.